La, la, la familia. <clears throat> Yo, what is going on, La Familia family? Welcome back to another video of yours, truly your boy, Gally Law, man. And sorry for the wait. I was trying to wait. As you guys know, last video, I told you guys I was going to do a pickers video. However, I'm just going to go ahead and do a pickers video of what I got right now. They're not too many. It's like seven to six items, but I like to say the heavy hitter hitters. You know what I'm saying? I think it's going to be part one, uh, like two weeks. I'm filming the part two for this video just because it all co coexists with one another if that makes sense but before we go ahead and get into the actual pickups it's gonna be a pickups unboxing video you guys know how i like to do them you know i like to have a little mystery box mysterious feel to everything before we go ahead and get into the video if you guys don't mind go ahead hitting the like button sharing subscribing hitting the naughty bell you already know how it go getting the algorithms booming also if you guys want to check out the boy outside of youtube i'm gonna leave the instagram cities and all that in the description below but with that being said let's go ahead and get into the video enough chitter chatter man i'm right into this man so i don't even know where to start off man i just see these right here i'm gonna go ahead and start off with these bad boys. actually no let me go ahead and start with the items that are already unboxed okay so first and foremost uh i'm gonna start real light i'm gonna start with accessories it's gonna be all over the place like i don't care i normally have a system um i've been a fan of real tree lately like real tree camo on you know pants on sweaters on shirts on hats one of the unboxing items i believe is the real tree hat as well but i want to go ahead and start off with this new era i am an astros fan and they had an astros variant of this new era cap right here with the real tree collaboration but it was sold out and they had they, they didn't have they had one but it wasn't my size um as you guys can see i have a bad hair day today man i just got my hair flowing today on some afro samurai type deal i'm a seven and a half now you know i got a big head now seven and a half fits me pretty pretty well you know not too tight but you know just right i mess with the hat but it's still fuck yankees i'm sorry I'm an Astros fan. Sorry, it just is what it is. The navy solid blue outside brim. I love the real tree camo on the outside with the cool little patch. I'm not too much of a patch guy. I got homies that like patches and whatnot. Maybe some of y'all do, but I like it. I like the more discreet type new eras. Um, standard new era cap MLB logo in the back. Real tree camo is really just like on point. Like it's got the right amount of branches and leaves and whatnot. I really like this dark um, green brim activity that's going on inside here and. Other other than that you know just a standard new era cap but just wanted to show you guys that this is a pickup that i just did actually last week i just went to a lids i saw it and i picked it up and yeah i'm a big hat guy so added it to the collection and the next pickup is one that i've been talking about for a while i actually got inspired by mr kyron mr kyron fellow youtuber he was discussing these cos cos dress pants slash pant um in this in this khaki colorway and they're super wide i've been having this for a while i just never got a chance to showcase it to the channel um just a really great pair of loose trousers great solid pair that you could wear formally or you know a little less formally with some streetwear combination team going on there but yeah overall a great great solid pair of trousers slash wide pants that i got from cos and let's go ahead and move on to the next item this next pick is a is a is a is a favor for me for me personally i think is a solid piece that i've been having in my mind for a while lately i don't know what even made me want to get this right here but i just feel like it was that time and it's not even that cold anymore but i just feel like it's that time you know from whenever i go to east side on some new york team on some canada team or i go you know somewhere where it's brick i got this brown jacket from jaded london collaboration with scott new york s-c-h-o-t-t -T. i'm not really too familiar with the brand obviously jaded london big fan of the brand i got endless 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 clothing pieces from jaded london and they did a collaboration i just saw it on the feed on ig saw a couple videos from jaded london posting it and advertising it all the way the models rocking it kind of this like punkish i know you guys with the with the little thingy right here it's kind of playboy cardi because you know playboy cardi wearing that super big like coat fur coat or whatever but this right here is a much more crop kind of bomber iteration of that and i've always seen this like this implementation this jacket silhouette on a lot of other brands and i've always been a big fan of it my true size is normally a medium but because i saw the instructions on how it fits so i decided to size up a little bit got a large if it's great hoodie is amazing very wide very cozy very comfy very very protective um in those windy colder weathers um inside is like a on the hood is like a sherpa type material inside the jacket has that same sherpa material as well followed with that heavy nylon material all around the jacket it has buckles on top of the zipper 
which is handy as well. And then elastic band on both bottom of the arms and the bottom of the jacket itself. No type of branding other than this Velcro detail they got on the left chest. Both of the little tags, both Jaden London and Scott New York, as well as on the side has a nice little arm pocket, like something you see on a standard bomber jacket or jacket in general. Yeah, overall, this jacket is very, very well made. It is on a pricier side, but as you guys can see, the quality is definitely there. Great, great, solid piece. That is pickup number three. Let's go ahead and move on to the next one. Okay, so for this next pickup, it's already been unboxed, but I wanted to put it on the bag that it came in with because I thought it was pretty pretty cool looking so this next item is a pair of slides sandals loafers you can say a mix of all three it is the afb x subu collaboration they did subu i'm not really too familiar with the brand but i know they are the originators of this silhouette that i'm about to show you guys they are the originators of this little loafer that they got going on and afb partnered up with them to implement their own variation of the item and colorway and it turned out very very well if i do say so myself so yeah this is the bag that it came in with cool little standard pouch nothing crazy pretty small but it's the details that matters you know what i'm saying so as you can see that's the standard a b logo with the stars in a circle and the inside i guess is the standard subu logo go ahead and unbox it it's not really unboxed but you guys know so i have wore these already go ahead and show you guys right here bang see them boys man so yeah as you guys can see these matched a lot with everything that's going on right now all the items that i just showed you guys they match completely simultaneously together as you guys can see i did put a little wear into them but nothing crazy so starting from the top i don't even know what material it is i guess it's like a soft soft leather very very soft but it is um padded with this inside kind of meshy type material on the inside got the subu logo subu logo on the side followed with these what really caught my eye was metal beads i guess you can call them and they're really solid metal beads really really caught my eye and i feel like it's a great great detail that that just separates them from every from everything else moving on to the inside like i said it does have a mesh underlining and just mesh material on the inside that is heavily padded and boosted so your foot is going to be very very comfortable inside and you guys already know i'm all about comfortability inside you got the afb logo in a nice bright cool orange very comfortable very durable it is a little bit weird to kind of walk with them at first you kind of got to get used to it because they do have a little bit of weight to them but yeah just a great great alternative to any other loafer there is in the market in my opinion so if you guys want to go in and check it out i'm not sure if, i'm pretty sure it's already sold out but subu as a whole has a lot of different cool colorways that you guys could check out and i'm pretty, pretty sure you guys will appreciate it as well that is item numero quattro let's go ahead and go into the unboxing section of the video not in any order I'm just gonna go ahead and open the first package that I got. So the first package is from Jonas Will Set You Free. That is our handle on IG and their website name, jonaswillsetyoufree.com. And I don't know how I stumbled across them, but I stumbled across them. And usually what I do when I just like see brands, I just keep them in my like one of my tabs in Safari open and I come back to them if I really mess with it just so like I don't I don't purchase it for no reason. I double down on it when I see it again on my on one of my tabs. And I just kept eyeing this item they had. So I was like, you know what? And on top of that, they had like a like a big sale haul going on because I guess they were moving warehouses or whatnot or they were getting prepared for the next collection. So I went ahead and appreciated the the sale going on. You know what I'm saying? But if you guys want to go ahead and check them out, it is Jonas will set you free. They are very low key. I did want to put them in one of my, uh, I think I might put them in one of my low key um, streetwear brands. And yeah, so I went ahead and picked up, I think a hat and a t-shirt. So yeah, so this is a mystery shirt that I got in a large mystery t-shirt. As you guys can see, here's the packaging, large. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm messing with the colorway, bro. So again, it is a mystery package, so I didn't choose this. They chose it for me. We're about to see what they're picking up right now. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, so it has this overall baby blue, light blue colorway to the shirt. It has their standard logo, I am guessing, and then Jonas in the bottom. But nothing in the back. Quality of the shirt is okay. Oh, it does have a star on the right. And other than that, I mean, it feels regular. No inside branding as well. This honestly looks like a sample they just did and they just threw in just cause, you know what I'm saying? But it is a large and I'm not going to lie. 
it fits like an XL, bro. That's that. Let's go ahead. I think I might take it to the tailor and have it cropped a little bit, but let's go ahead and move on to the next item. So the next item, again, it is from the same people over there at Jonas will sell you free. This is a box though, so we gotta get some. We gotta get some teams to open this team. I just came from the gym too. Oh, okay, 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 okay. It's been a long time. This, these, these packages have been sitting here for a long time, so I forgot what I got to be honest. Okay, so remember I told you guys that I've been, I've been, I've been, I've been on a real tree camo spree lately, man. Like actually. Speaking of real tree, I actually caught this uh little camo beanie from them as well. Here is that hat that I got from them boys, and this is actually with Kama Eye from the brand. On the front has Jonas written in this um, weird gothic -y font as another logo on the top. And yeah, just real tree camo print all over the front and the brim of the hat. I feel like I can match it with a lot of different outfits just to offset the tone and give it a different look per se, but yeah. That's the real tree X Jonas collab they had going on. Let's go ahead and move on to the next item. And the next, the next item is a shirt from them. That again, on my eye as well. Yeah, so it doesn't really say the actual name or you know, just branding of the shirt. But yeah, so this is the shirt right here. As you guys can see, it is very like kind of Kanye expired with the Jesus and whatnot and the logo. But it says Jonas on the vertical side and Jonas on the horizontal side forming a little cross. It has the same logo on the tag, on the collar. And it is a nice like creamish look. It is a long sleeve, but it is a more oversized fit. Kind of get, you know, like a Pablo type vibe for of this and that's what kind of caught my eye really is very oversized so what size did i get on this i got a i got a large on it thinking it was going to be a little bit more true to size but looking back into it i probably would have got a medium also has the same logo on the end of the sleeve and on the end of the other sleeve as well other than that it's just you know your standard cotton material or whatnot 100 cotton nothing too crazy but yeah that is jonas will set you free little three pack they got going on right there and they also were kind enough to send a cool little sticker let's go ahead and move on to the last last item and this brand right here is official in my opinion i think i think they're based off in europe somewhere in europe i believe it's spain let me see yeah i believe they're based in spain and the brand is called i don't even know how to pronounce it to be honest it's um scuffers scuffers s-c-u-f-f-e-r-s I don't know how I got into this, how I even came across this brand either. That's probably 80% of the brands. I don't know how I come across them, but I came across them and their side looks official. They had a whole bunch of different collections, a whole bunch of different items. I'm talking jeans, pants, sweatshirts, sweatpants. I'm talking hoodies, beanies, accessories and whatnot. So they're official, man. They're already doing their team. It's a nice little sticker they offered as well. Might be glowing the dark, I don't know. But that's hat. Mm. So, the packaging, and it's a pair of uh, of jeans, a pair of denim. Um, they have a lot, a lot of denim, but we really come eye on these. Is that first of all, they're gray. I don't really have that many two gray denim or pant in general, so I decided to cop these. And they also added the nice detail to have like a little shoelace belt for it. And you know, shoelace belts have been crazy hot lately. Like I've seen them in every fit pick lately. I personally like the aesthetic. I like the look on it, so I'm here for it. And that's another reason why I even got these jeans to begin with. Got the Scuffers logo on the inside. Zipper fly, but in closing, very, very great quality to it. Not too heavy, kind of has a nice soft material to it. Bottom opening is almost like a raw cut to it. As you guys can see, it is very wide. The implementation of the logo in the back of the pant with their signature logo in the nice bright yellow just to accompany the shoelace just looking at it doesn't look that wide but i'm going to go ahead and put it on right now man because wow solid man so yeah i'm not gonna lie boys it's solid this is solid honestly i could size up this is definitely a cotton set of jeans for sure i gotta double check that but i feel like these are way way more soft than your regular you know denim yeah that is scuffers and yeah that's gonna go ahead and do it for the pickups hope you guys enjoyed the video man um i know it was a short one but hopefully a sweet one for you guys coming back for part two real shortly I'm gonna come in with some more videos before that with that being said my memory is running short so i gotta cut it short almost close to that 500 sub mark appreciate you guys for all the support and i'll go ahead and catch you guys on the next video peace